Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can refresh pages on Safari very fast, very easy. So basically what you have to do is just to click on this button right over here. So if you want to reload this page, so that's how you refresh a page on your on Safari. And another method, guys, you can also tab with your, if you're using your, your, um, your trackpad, you can tab with two fingers, so tag with tap with two fingers and here you should see reload page so click on that and you reload your page because you don't want to move your cursor right over here it takes more time so if you want to improve your productivity be more productive that's what i would do and just tap two fingers and click on reload page now but maybe what if you don't use your truck your trackpad you use your mouse in case you're using your mouse and you don't want to, you know, go here or to tab with two fingers because you can't because you use your mouse, you can also use the command command plus R or the shortcut command. You can faster refresh. So yeah, just use this keyboard shortcut command plus R. So let's test command plus R. And yeah, it works without any issues. Command plus R, command plus R, command plus R, command plus R, command plus R. By the way, someone asked me how they can uh, open the emojis. So you press Fn plus E. You can open emojis and this can be helpful, you know, Fn, E, uh, you want to add emojis very fast. It is actually, okay, it's kind of like lagged a little bit. As you can see, it's kind of laggy. No, it's not really responsive if you ask me. So I click on here, look how, how long it takes to actually, it's a bug or something, I don't know. So um, now, yeah, let's recap two fingers with your fingers and tab two fingers. Tab with two fingers and then select reload page or use the command or you or use the shortcut command plus E. I said command plus E, command plus R, sorry. Command plus R, R from reload, and or use your mouse and go to your mouse here to click on here. But the one that I use is Command plus R, R from reload. So um, now another thing here, also go to system settings. And if you want to see Safari in dark, click on dark here. This can be helpful. And uh, 